Hello, my name is Joel Labava, and I'm the Franchise King, which is the only reason that I'm holding something like this, my crown. Anyway, put that crown away for a minute. This is about you and about something that really, really bothers me uh, as it relates to folks that want to become a franchise owner or possibly become the owner of a franchise. It's, a, it's an answer to a question that uh, I ask you on the free franchise quiz that I uh, developed about uh, six years ago now. You can find it on thefranchiseking.com forward slash blog. And if you slide down a little to the right-hand side, you'll see free franchise quiz. Take it if you haven't already. I personally score it myself. There's no automation involved. And it's, uh, it includes uh, several questions that will help you decide if franchise ownership is for you. Question number 18 uh, is a really important question, and it tells me so much about you and your readiness to become the owner of a franchise. And, you know, a franchise involves a business system, something you need to follow. So let me, let me explain this. The question is, will you do whatever it takes, including investing a little money beforehand to learn exactly how to choose and research the best franchises available? Simple question. Are you willing to pay for some help before you, you, you know, before you make the decision, before you pull the trigger, sign the franchise agreement, and send in a check for thirty dollars or $40,000 for the franchise fee? Here are the three choices that you can check off in response to that question. A, yes, I'm interested in getting the help I need. I want to do this right. All right. B, no, I'm going to do this alone. I can handle this. And three, maybe, but I'm going to need to be convinced that I really shouldn't do this alone. People that answer B, no, I'm going to do this alone, I can handle it, really worry me. And I have to tell you, and I'll share a little secret about how I, how I score the free franchise quiz, um, you lose a lot of points. The score goes down in your quiz if you answer, no, I'm going to do this alone, I can handle it. And here's why. If you're not willing to get help before you become the owner of a franchise, to me it says that you can do it yourself in your own mind. You're not worried about it, and you'll just kind of figure it out. And as a franchisee, as the owner of a franchise, it's nice to be able to think on your feet. But remember, you have a whole corporation behind you that is going to train you, is going to provide a 300-page operations manual, is going to help you with marketing, etc., the things that are in a business system, it's their business system. And, and you have to be willing to follow it. So I, it makes me wonder if you are too much of a solo person, too much of a, maybe an entrepreneur, to follow a system and be willing to get the help needed and to ask for help. Now, admittedly, the question does include investing a little money. So that means that will you work with a professional like me, an advisor, in, in kind of trying to figure this all out? If you're willing to do that, that tells me a lot about you, that you're willing to do whatever it takes because you want to do this right, and you're open to learning from people that may know a little more than you do about what it takes to become a successful franchise owner. So I want you to think about that. Even if you don't take the free franchise quiz, I want you to think about this. Are you willing and able to ask for help? Will you even pay for a little professional help before you do anything? Because if you won't, and, and you don't feel like you need to, I think there's a problem. Because buying a franchise is a big deal. It's big. It could be life-changing. Not only if you're successful, but if you're unsuccessful, because you can lose a heck of a lot of money. So I want you to think about that. I am the Franchise King, Joel Labava. Thanks for watching this video. And let me know if I can help you figure this whole franchise thing out.